Hi, welcome to the iLab where ideas are shared, created, and tested. Come on in. This is where we store child projects. Adult projects choose mostly it's their students. Um, it's a little bit messy right now, but they designate a cubby and then they can store their projects. This is a really big and important aspect of having a makerspace, is having a place to store stuff while it's in progress. The other kinds of storage that we have to consider in a makerspace is materials. There's lots of materials, most of which is free that you can get from e-waste, stuff that's been taken apart already. More material storage that's more accessible to students is these level one materials. This is for rapid prototyping. So that's stuff that you want kids to be able to do within an hour class, no problem. We also have a set of um, NXT robotics that kids use for various solutions that they do. We also have Arduinos that we would store in the level three area for more sophisticated robotics projects that we do in our electives. But we also have a, a system of organizing our tools that are also available and open to students on a level of one, two, and three. Three being the most difficult to use or the most dangerous, and one being open access to anyone, no particular training needed. Level two would be stuff like a multimeter or um, digital calipers. Um, we also display connectors as much as possible and adhesives out. We also have a tower specifically designated for textiles, so that can be ironing patterns. We have that stuff here. We have basic hand needles and we have electronic sewing machines. We also have a tower that's completely dedicated to electronics, and so that can be like a lot of harvested e-waste motors and lights that kids are allowed to play with and destroy, no big problem. Power supplies. Another thing that makes the iLab unique is the fact that students can arrange their work area how they want, when they want to do it, because all of the furniture can be stacked and folded and put against the sides of the walls in a reset mode.